you can do a lot with your precision touchpad in Windows 10. Let's discover some of its features. First of all, how do you know if your touchpad is a precision touchpad? Click on the Start button, click on Settings, then click on Devices, and finally click on Touchpad. Do you see this message? Your PC has a precision touchpad. If yes, then you're good to go. Otherwise, check our videos on standard touchpad settings. Let's go through the basic settings of your precision touchpad. There is a switch to turn it off and on, and a checkbox to disable the touchpad whenever you connect a mouse. There's also a slider to adjust the pointer speed. The advanced settings are arranged into four groups, taps, scroll and zoom, three finger gestures, and four finger gestures. The tap settings gives you the option to use taps instead of clicking buttons. For example, if you choose tap with two fingers to right click, then tapping with two fingers has the same effect of a right click using your mouse. If you like using taps but you get accidental taps while you're typing on the keyboard, reduce the sensitivity. The scroll and zoom settings let you choose to scroll and zoom in and out by swiping two fingers on the touchpad. You can also invert the scrolling direction. The three finger gestures and four finger gestures offer you more possibilities and can be easily customized using the preset configurations. The standard three finger gestures are swipe up to show the task view, swipe left and right to switch between tasks, and swipe down to show the desktop. You can change the actions using the drop down menu, and the same goes for the four finger gestures. Customize them to better suit your needs. You can also click on Advanced Gesture Configuration to create a custom set of actions. If anything goes wrong, hit the Reset button and restart. 